it seemed like uh, it just seemed very natural, and I the resources kind of opened themselves up to me. It wasn't something I I think it was you know it had a lot to do with Dan doing work shed. And I was like, oh, God, he's doing a really cool label. I want to do some stuff. You know, I just wanted to, you know, I was always trying to stay involved in things. You know, I did, I worked at Zed. I put on shows. I worked at shows. And so putting out records and playing in a band were just two more parts of the puzzle. So when you say the resources open themselves up, what do you mean by that? Are you talking about with cargo and like, can you kind of explain that a uh, little bit? Oh, uh, this is the way before cargo. Cargo was more like the end, the end of it. The, the thing with cargo was the guy I was working with, uh, Kane Boychuk, um, he, he had like set up all these, um, accounts with like people so he was like my in like getting records manufactured um getting records distributed and i think it just it, it grew really quickly to where he i don't think he could um he could handle the workload anymore so that's when he he went to cargo or cargo came to him i forget which happened but, you know, it was, I enjoyed it a lot more when it was just Kane and I, you know, working in a one-on-one -on -one relationship. I always trusted Kane. He always was, he always made it really easy for me to do things.